Hi guys, welcome to a new video. Um, today we're going to look at one of my ficus trees. Um, this one has been with me for several years. It's taken, you know, quite a different look. It's, it, it, I think I originally purchased it just as a big box, you know, twisty trunk ficus, maybe yeah, eight, ten years ago, something like that. And like I said, it's been with me just kind of growing. Um, last winter, I took a big cutting off of it. And this was, you know, another big tree. And I ended up planting that one in a kind of a landscape um, raft style planting. And I'll maybe show a picture up, up here. Um, I've done a couple videos on it since I planted it that way. I've done some maintenance pruning, whatever. But anyway, here's here's what was left over, and this was more of a kind of an upright tree. Um, just had a weird shape because what really my goal was, I liked the base, I liked the exposed roots, how thick the the trunk was, and the base down here. But I wasn't really sure what I was going to do with the top, and I'm still not totally sure. But um, I'll just kind of show you where it's at today, and. Do a little pruning on it and just kind of share my vision so far with it but it may change in the future um, so we'll just kind of see see where it goes but my overall goal is to not have these on here and just kind of let it kind of come up and be kind of a hybrid you know literati style kind of windswept at the top you know something like that but I'm leaving these down here just to help heal this big cut point, you know, just to make all this area grow faster and, and heal better. So, but I am going to prune some of those back today um, just to kind of get them out of the way so I can see what the, the shape of the tree is, but they'll, they'll continue to grow. Um, and that doesn't take away from the, the look too much. Nice movement, really thick base. I'll put my hand down here for the for a size reference. So it's probably a good, you know, three or four inches across. And then it tapers out really nicely up here. And then I'd like to get this into, you know, develop these branches more and get it more into a kind of a triangle canopy looking shape over here. So Today we're going to start that refinement and take some of these branches down just to, so I can get it to start ramifying a little more up here and get, it's not going to take a whole lot of time to, to prune this guy up today, but just thought I'd share it with you since, um, I think I did the video when I trunk chopped it during the winter and um, just I always like to you know make updates to the trees I'm working on just so everybody can see how long it takes just kind of each step that it takes along the progress to develop a tree so but I kind of like like where this one's going um, even bend some of these down to make it more of a cascade type thing. Not really sure where I'm going with it yet, but I, I would I, I do want to keep that movement in the in the branches up here so that kind of a to match the shape of the trunk. It's got some twists and curves, so I just want to keep that movement going throughout the top of it. So that's why I have the wire on, and that's kind of kind of my goal. Just reposition this one a little bit. So yeah, I think that I like that. Yeah, so I think I think that might be about all I'm gonna do to it. I do see, looking at it from the, the side view, I'm looking at it here, so I'll kind of let you guys see 
it looks like it's kind of flat on the back. So I'm going to bring this branch out here and then kind of bring it back towards the front just so when you're looking at it from the side that it's got equal depth and then looking at it from the front that really didn't change the front view too much. So it just kind of moved that one branch back, which gives it a better look front to back. So just trying to keep that balanced. So yeah. That'll probably, probably just about do it here. Just a quick video on this one, just to um, more of an update than anything. Just kind of see how it's coming along. So, yeah. I like it. So that'll do it for today. Let me give you a quick spin around. There's the front. There's the left side. There's the back. Right side. And back to the front. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.